Welcome to the Neon Nightcast channel. Let's play of Lisa the Painful. One of also podcast. Yeah, one of my actually favorite games of all time. So the this game Michael always talks about. I so was, now I'll, I'll finally get to see I was, how much it's been hyped up. The, the panel RPG. It's a indie game made by Dingaling, as you saw. Uh, <laughs> you can read that text, right? Yeah. Dingaling's a fucked up mind. He wants you to play with his Dingaling, meaning his game. So yes, mm. this was a game that I was pretty obsessed with for a long time, and it's still resonated with me. It's shut up, Brad. Somebody getting their ass you blistered. Stole our ball. Cut me a switch. I stole. So the story behind it for me is uh, one day on YouTube, a person that I follow named Slow Beef was let's playing this game, and this first intro, I just stopped the video and I was like, I gotta play this for myself. <laughs> This flashing red screen with dialogue. Well, you'll you'll see. Okay. Idiot. Whoa! What's with that black guy with a turnip head? He dyed his hair blonde. He just has a turnip head. So we play as Brad Armstrong, one of the most. Are his arms strong. One of his arms are strong. So he basically take took the heat and he got beat up for his friends. Man, fuck his friends. He's a martyr. They should get stronger. Uh Brad Armstrong is one of the most miserable characters I've ever seen in any anything. Is that a dead Nazi? Like a Nazi zombie? That's a no, weird look. It looks like Ranger Smith. From Yogi Bear. <laughs> that was just a weird dude hanging out there. So here we are. Everything's normal. Why are you um, walking with your head down? Because I just got the... I'm bleeding. He's, he's got uh, the shit kicked out of him. Hey, there's Mr. Dink. This guy won't talk to us. He's just cutting his grass. I think cutting that's... Cutting his grass. <sighs> oh, his grass. Yeah. So that was our house, but let's just go a little bit further and see if there's any secrets, right? Like, you already know if there's a secret. So obviously there's a secret over here you want to show us. I don't know. Why, did, why, why is every just, tree leaning in a different direction? Us. Oh, that's our house. Oh, wait, this is our house. Yeah, do you see how shitty it is? That's our yeah, house. Yeah, that's sad. Looks like a lot of the houses in the town we grew oh. up in. Oh, look, is it dad's Brad? Who's that? <laughs> Olaf. Brad's dad. It's perfect. Now let's go. Let's go meet Brad's dad. The the wonderful man he is. Do it. Ooh. Fatty just sitting on a couch smoking his cigarettes, enjoying a strobe light. He was watching TV. Oh, I get it. Once again. Beat. Two shirt. Wow. I'm not buying you another shirt. Worth shit, kid. Don't you I love, know? I love those flat top shades he's got on, though. Those are sick. Okay. Uh. Well, how do we know which one's our room? Ah, oh, fuck. I wanted to go. Boy. You can go see uh, um his little sister as a baby. So there's a little. So, there you go, he weeps. His life is shit. There's a little bit of a backstory to Lisa. Uh, the previous game was about his sister, Lisa, who... It's like a... Tra you travel into her mind, and it's about her father being abusive and whatever, and she ends up killing herself. This game is the sequel... As in, it's the same family, it's his her brother, and this is the man he's become. How does Brad travel into her mind? No, that's, it's her in her mind. Okay, what's that game called? Uh, I think it's just called Lisa. So, so they're both called Lisa? This is Lisa the Painful RPG. Oh. 
Dude, you got a sick hair, dude. Yeah, look at him. He's got sweet hair, man. What the hell? This baby just came out of nowhere. It's really cute. It's like crying. Whoa. Whoa there, Brad. Don't... Oh my Jesus. <laughs> he dropped it. I'm sorry, baby. Ah. Brad looks like he's got scoliosis. Curved spine. Guy he's always leaning. Well, he's got a baby on him. <laughs> he was standing like that before he had the baby. Yeah. Well, he was hunched over taking <laughs> drugs. Dude, Brad, why you gotta go to drugs? He is a very, very sad man. I hope you guys appreciate this game. Is Lisa already dead? Yeah. Uh, they'll kind of talk about it, but uh, an event happened, and there are no women left on Earth. So it's just, all the men are just basically living it up, waiting to die. Jesus. Sounds terrible. Is that a baby? Who's gonna call out guys on their shit? Other guys. <laughs> You'll see, this game's fucking... It's fudging ridiculous. Where'd you get that? Oh, I don't know. I just found a lion on the ground. <laughs> you know what this means? This means there's a girl out there. Oh, he's a he's a uh, pee hound. If you get what I'm saying. Oh, oh Eric, they're the, all the guy, pee hounds. The guy in the green shirt looks like Job of the Hut. So these, <laughs> yeah. The guy with male pattern baldness looks like a clown. Uh, <laughs> these these were the friends that we uh, saved, by the way, from the bullies. What these guys? Yeah. I don't so, think so. Does it mean? They got beat up on the school playground, so I'm just assuming they got raped. Oh, oh, it's a, I mean, it's a girl, you guys. Wow. Do you have to kill your friends? We need to tell someone, Rando. If we came to him with this, we get set for life. So Rondo is a gang leader that just controls this part of the world for a little bit. name is Rando, Mike. Rando. What was I saying? Rondo. Oh, sorry. That's just what like I said. Pennsylvania Rondo of blood. That's just what I always said in my head. Well, you need to fix it in your head. That's not his name. So Brad wants to defend this baby. He wants to keep this baby safe. Just because his sister died. Ah, good connecting Show there. Show don't yeah, tell. It's like. obvious. <laughs> it's like you, you can't make a game with a guy and his sister dying and then a little baby girl showing up and he's like, no. Oh, this is yeah, my second up, chance. Yeah, I think the rule is if you introduce a baby in the first act, you have to bring it back in the third act. Is that a real thing? <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> that's like that's that's it's, like if if there's an item. <laughs> yeah. So here we go, a little cutscene. Brad's quitting drugs, boys. Do it, Brad. Do it. Bet you won't, you punk. Wow. Well, what are they digging for? What is that? This is their house, and uh, they're what making. They doing? They're making Lisa a little Lisa. They're making Buddy. A little a room for her, so they can keep her safe and hidden. Uh... They just named her Buddy. Yeah. Buddy's a... Buddy's a bad... Oh! Whoa, it's Daddy. There's no way. And there's a little baby. Oh, is it Lisa? Yeah, it's... This is an illusion. Because it was drugs. Yeah. Oh, the drugs made him... Made the thoughts go away. Or did the drugs make the thoughts appear? 
No, buddy, don't go. Look, we're bald now, friends. Poor guys. Everyone goes bald in this world. <laughs> yeah, bad, bad <laughs> genetics all around. He's so sad. Oh, more drugs. Oh, now he's actually trying to quit drugs. <laughs> I really like this game a lot. Yes, you keep saying it, Mike. <laughs> well, like, I can hear the music, and it's really sad that you guys can hear the music, because it's really, really well face? done. He made her a mask. He made a mask. So oh. He was like... recognized that she's a girl. Yeah. She's putting makeup on him. Well, oh, they aged terribly. Job of the hut. Sitting down again. <laughs> that guy's just chilling, man. He's just ready to, like, for mankind to die out. <laughs> I ain't stood up since since the women left. And I ain't and planning some, on doing some, it now. <laughs> oh, God. And something else hasn't stood up since the women left. Ho ho. <laughs> He had a dream about his, his sister. And, and his abusive father. Oh, no. He's going back to the drugs. Or the, drugs the drugs make everything okay. He, he left the drugs right at the end of the edge of the Mario 3 ending screen. Aha! <laughs> Like, even the flower next to him is sad. All right, oh, so... look at your friend. Hey, is that a doggo or a pupper? Uh, it's a big old doggo. Sorry, a big old <laughs> pupper. Uh, so you know what? We're going to let you two make the decisions in the game. Unless... No, please won't leave me alone. Unless I'm really against it. But I'm going to let you guys make the decisions. Why wow, this guy wants to kill his doggo? Well, it's it's got him trapped in the in the tree. Oh, it's rabbit or something. Oh, do I remember? Attacking this dog. I don't remember things. Also, I'm gonna just turn this down a little. Why? It's too loud. The battle music's really loud or something? Yeah, the battle music was really loud. <clears throat> oh, I don't have skills yet. Okay. I'm strong style. Are you just doing zipper punches, Mike? I'm just doing zipper punches. I don't have why any... You, why, why are you punching him in a zipper? Ah, uh, now I leveled up. I have a new skill. Okay. Wow. Poor little doggo. Maybe you can handle some kind of difficulty. Can we play in pain mode, friends? What? We, okay, well, explain what is pain mode. Pain mode is one you save, uh, save thing. <laughs> well, I feel like this might that might end up fucking over the game. Yeah, no, 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 yeah, play, yeah, so. no, yeah. We're gonna play normal. <laughs> I wasn't gonna pick pain mode. <laughs> I hurt my H string. I'm Terry Hints. His hint string? I guess it is his hint string. Take the balloon. You want me to take I the want, balloon? I want the balloon. Okay. Oh, he joined your team. This balloon just saved your life. I doubt it. I, I think I could have seen the cliff. Do you, Bottles. Do you want me to read the hints, or do you want me to just go? Just go. You know what to do. Yeah, okay. you know, you know my. Oh! I just what? saved over one of my files. <laughs> <laughs> was that bad? Yeah. Oh, well, I wasn't. I was done with that file, but it's just there's so many. Uh, there's so many places to... There's so many save files, I should have just kept it, but it's too late now. Too late now. 
So this game has a mechanic where if you rest at campfires, you get fully healed. But what can happen is a bunch of you random... Attacked at night. You can get attacked. You can... Oh. You can have uh, party, party members get taken away from you. It's really... Yeah. Oh, Frendo is dead. Oh. Secrets out, Brad. Brad. Took her. She's gone. They took her. And they're gonna, they're gonna do bad things to her, Brad. Sorry, guy. I don't, wanna, I don't wanna play this game. This is, there's something I gotta do. Why? Cause she's gonna be sad. And she's gonna be like, oh, it's all about rape. Girls get raped all no, the time. No, it has, it has a lot of really funny moments. You'll be fine. You're dead inside already, right? Right, Garrett? No. What happened to Terry? He oh, he just, like, rejoined you? Yeah. Right, who's that guy? The guy in the red. <laughs> Uh, these are just random, uh, Rondo soldiers. Where are your other friends? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe we'll find them. They betray you? I don't know. They totally betrayed you. So, this game was made in R- This game was made in RPG Maker. Ew. Well, he clearly had some knowledge of Pearl. Oh, yeah, for sure. Like, because it's... I didn't know you could make a platformer an RPG make. <gasps> oh, my God, Mike. <laughs> so that's... Why don't you open your eyes? That's one of the mechanics of the game is... Instant deaths. Instant death pits. Why are you going back down here? For mystery jerky, my friend. Who wants mystery jerky? That sounds disgusting. It does sound disgusting, actually. Let's kill him. Kill, kill him. They took your. They took your buddy. I want that little bitch all myself. They took your buddy. Kill them. Okay, what's my thing? WWS. Punch. W. W. What did I what did I say? WWS? Yes. There we go. So now we can do Terry, you fucking suck. What yeah. What does he even do? He's just falling over. Wow, he's so good. By the way, Terry, does Uncle Ted from Bobby's World know you raided his wardrobe? Oh, it's actually a uh, yeah. Uh, there'll be um a thing up. And later, tell me what crying does. I don't I don't remember. That's just essentially what I'm trying to say to you is I don't remember. It means that a girl with snake bites and dyed black hair is now attracted to you. I wish. Uh, yeah, actually, me too. That sounds pretty good. Oh, it's a cave. Get ready for caves. How are all these people dead? Such an ugly... Hey! He's talking so bad about Buddy. Unless there's another woman out there. Some scraggly old toothless whore. She could be scraggly. I don't know. Could she be old and toothless and a whore? He dead. She could be a very nice woman for all we know. He's Clearly dead. Attractive. I mean, these guys don't know what you know attractiveness is. They haven't seen a woman in ages. This guy, what? So he wasn't actually dead. Oops. We're just killing him. Terry, why do you fucking suck? Terry, so I mean, he told us he was a great warrior. Yeah, I saw that. So, is he a liar? Definitely a liar. Oh, you, you gotta kill him. You gotta 
You got an ability though. Maybe I'll try her out. All right. Oh, maybe, maybe it'll be worth. But maybe I'll try that out next time on Lisa oh. Painful. See you next okay. time. Okay. Bye.